So, guess who's back? Hi. I know, it's been a millennia, practically, and I'm gonna do a video about what's been going on and what happened and everything, but I thought, like the, you know, quality YouTuber I have never been, I would start doing vlogs. So, hi, this is the first vlog. It's October 1st, 2017, and today was installation day at the art garage.
so I have made it home from the gallery because, you know, trick-or-treating, I mean, we don't have a lot of kids in our neighborhood, but yeah, I, I'm a firm believer that any kid who comes to my door and the adults get candy or a toy. Yeah, I, I, I give out toys too. I mean, they're not exciting toys or anything, but I'm there are lots of kids who can't have candy for whatever reason, like allergies. Like, I was a kid with lots of allergies. It was amazing that I could enjoy Halloween at all, considering the amount of allergies I had. So, I try and have toys for the kids. They're not super exciting, though. We, we have some we have soldiers and zombies and bits and bobs to go with them and dinosaurs. Super exciting dinosaurs. And this year, I found skeletons. And it's like, look, the skeleton army is in the thing. So hopefully this will make kids happy. Weirdly enough, I actually get more kids who take toys than I do kids who take candy. So I don't know if that's just preference or allergies or what. And I always have to encourage them to take more than one because we get way too much of everything. But yeah, um, our trick-or-treating goes from five to seven tonight which is just like what's the what's the point honestly of trick-or-treating then but yeah it's like I'm not even sure what the point in having trick-or-treating is when it's only two hours it's not really enough time to get to get anywhere especially when you live out in the middle of nowhere Wisconsin which is basically where I live I'm not wearing anything exciting tonight I have my my Sagas of Sundry Dread shirt on so you know blame the goat man but I was thinking as I'm totally off frame here of wearing my cute Sorbet Jungle uh, Aries hat uh, it's not Aries, it's um, it's called Sunram. Yes, Sunram hat. I mean, I do have, I do have my actual ram's horns I could wear, and I have a myriad of other strange hats I could wear, including a pirate bunny that I got many years ago, but um, I think I'm going to stick with this. It's cute, and it probably won't freak out the kids, because, you know, we get little, little kids. So, yeah. I think we're going to go with this. And, you know, again, Sorbet Jungle, check them out. I will put a link in the thing below, the drawer, the description box, whatever we're calling it this time. I will put it in there. And, yeah, you should check them out, because they have adorable, adorable things. Okay. More preparation, and I need to feed myself before the kids come because I haven't eaten today. Good job, me. And go. Monster Squad is legitimately one of my favorite bad horror movies.